everyone and welcome back to a new video how are all of you guys doing today hopefully well today's story i am reading is injury soundwave x human female reader and uh <laughs> let's get started <clears throat> reader prof it was yet again another day on the Nemesis. Everything was surprisingly more calm than when I got here. Megatron was acting more down to... Cyrotron, if you will. Starscream wasn't screaming. Knockout wasn't buffing. Freddy King wasn't breaking anything. Shockwave was in his underground lab. And the V-Cons were all getting along. The only thing that was the same was Soundwave. He was silent as normal. Megatron was my guardian, which meant I went into battle with him. Shockwave found an Energon mine not too far from his lab, so I had to go on yet another mission. Megatron was about to take off w until Soundwave showed up behind him. Yes, Soundwave? Megatron asked. He stared at him, but it felt like his optics were on mine. I'll keep her safe. Do not worry. Megatron smirked and took off, uh, me landing in his jet seat. I sat there in silence, but I was tense. Why so tense, human? Megatron asked. What did Soundwave say to you? I asked calmly. That I keep you safe, he responded. But he's not my guardian. Why would he? I trailed off. It was true. I have had a crush on the silent mech's mech after the first two weeks of meeting of being on the nemesis but i never thought i never thought he'd do that for me we're here megatron transformed and landed uh, and i did multiple flips before uh thrusting one leg downwards and landing on megatron's shoulder megatron uh strides in into the mine an evil glare and scowl on his faceplate. Mine match mine my face matching his. I guess that's why Megatron uh, appointed himself as my guardian. He set me down and went to talk to Starscream that was surprisingly here before us. <laughs> uh I walked around getting a good look at my fellow comrades. Uh so uh, survive on. After a while, I got bored and sat down on the ground while I watched V-Cons drill and export the Energon uh, into the ground bridge and back into the ship. <clears throat> Soon I hear Chuck's horn and immediately sp uh, sprung up, taking out my blasters that Soundwave made it especially for me, and later Shockwave made it better, so more lasers came out of it as well as other laser laser settings. The truck transformed an Optimus Prime, who was accompanied by a Indy five hundred that soon that became Smokescreen and a muscle car that became Bumblebee. Autobots, I breathed. Soundwave Prov. They all just came back from the mission. I silently walked to the medical to the med bay to see how many were in were in there. The first thing I see in there is your name. I quickly walked over and tapped and tapped on Knockout's shoulder. He looked up. Oh, Soundwave, I thought you would come. He said I I turned my head to your name and then back to him. Autobots. The new one, Smokescreen, shot at her, but she dodged. However, it hit a few pieces of Energon, which made it explode. She flew for a couple of feet before rolling and sliding across the floor. The rest. Yeah, then, uh, his knockout gave an uh, a accurate description. I became angry. I told Megatron to keep her safe and for the new mech to even remotely shoot in her direction. I look at Knockout again. She's in stasis while I repair uh, some cuts here and there. Um, she can really take a hit, you know. 
uh, um, one of the Vicons witness witnesses said that she got right back up, right back up, and charged at him. She, yeah, uh, she she got him good in the leg. The knockout kept going. I turned and left. Uh, when she wakes up, I needed to speak with her. Reader Prov. I woke up in knockout med bay. Uh, I slowly sit up before knockout notices. I slide out of the bed and to my luck, a vehicle steps in so I could leave as soon as, soon as I sprinted down the hall. Someone scooped me up, scooped me up. I turned to see who it was and it was Soundwave. He was staring at me. Uh, hi. I smiled. Statement. I like you. I have for a while. He was straight up. My eyes widened and I could feel my f face heat up. I had never heard his voice before. Uh, <laughs> uh, I rubbed the back of my neck. I, I love you too. I smiled. Question. Love me? Tom Wolf tilted, tilted his head some. Uh, I tried coming up with an excuse, but he lifted his uh, visor quickly and kissed me. I caught a glimpse of his purple optics before he, quick, before he quickly lowered his visor once again. Statement. I love you too. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching.